The Cincinnati Public Schools Scholar Athlete of the Month program was designed to recognize model scholar athletes that excel in the classroom, the community, and their respective field of play. Let's head over to the school to recognize this month's excellent scholar athlete. We are here at Walnut Hills High School, home of the Eagles, presenting our April Scholar Athlete of the Month Award to our scholar athletes who excel in the community, in the classroom, and on their respective field of play. We're excited to present this award to junior tennis player, Ravanth Machanila. Yeah, Ravanth, let's go. Let's go. Uh, one of the favorite sports memories we had was going down to um, Sycamore last year, um, winning a match versus the best team in the state right now. So that made it really competitive for winning at least one match against them. Also, it was very competitive throughout, between, even though we lost the match. We still played a, like, a very good team, the team that won state overall. And it was just really competitive and really fun for the team. And it was a great experience to have for everybody and a great memory that I'll hold forever. We have a fun environment. Our tennis team is just, it's seven players. We're all like very, we're all like very nice to each other and we, we've become a team throughout like all the journeys and all like the hardships we've faced throughout like three seasons together. But yeah, our team is just like very tight knit. And then we like, we just, I don't know, like we play a lot of, we play a lot of tennis together and we spend a lot of time together and spend a lot of time outside the tennis court. That just creates a bond between us and we just kind of become brothers and we've allowed ourselves to become friends outside of the tennis courts as well. So academics are really important. Just being from a household with two college graduates, they've really forced me to like pursue academics and to keep good grades because that's like one of the main ways you can succeed in life. It's not the only way, but it's one of the main ways that you can show like you're, you're dedicated to something and you can like experience like what hardships. Because in academics, it's not just all, oh, you're smart, you can go through. You still have to study and you still have to put in the work. So it's prepped me by putting in the work. And also just like allowing me for, allowing academics is just a way for me to like get off some stress out of my brain. So it puts a lot of stress on me, but it helps me like let out some stress from just other things in like in my daily life. I tutor um, two times a week with children around the community for free. Um, I allow, I'm a part of the Jets club here, which just nurtures engineering and science. So I actually lead that club as a captain. Um, and I also help um, volunteer at hospitals around the city and just a lot of my community service has just been helping people in need like with helping people in the elderly community and people that are medically unfit to do things. My parents, they've always paid for my tennis lessons because tennis is a pretty expensive sport to pick up, so you have to pay enormous amounts of money just to start playing tennis. And also, like my brother, he's put in the work with me and he's played with me for so long just to like get better at the sport and to get to the level where I'm at right now. Um, also, just like the tennis coaches at my local club, Queen City Racquet Club, they've always helped me and they've always been so supportive been starting at seven to now they've always they knew who I am and like it's more of a friendship than it's just the coach is there so they just help me build on the strengths of my game and help me grow as a person as well tennis is like it's not very popular among high school sports and to just get that recognition for all the hours that we put in and tennis is not an easy sport to pick up on so it's something that you need to put a lot of time into and you need to practice because the only way you're going to get better at practice at tennis is through repetition and through practice as like any other sport. So it's something just to get recognition for it and it just feels so great because you're getting a recognition for like all the hours you put in through the off season. Really there is no off season during the tennis season because once you finish the high school tennis season you go into your own like private season. So 
without an off season, you're just putting in so much work and putting in, like putting so much stress on your body. So it's something just to get recognition for all the hard work you put in. Yeah, so my parents, mom, dad, my brother, um, my coach, Coach Liz, my teammates, so that's Anish, Ron, Garish, Rapigan, Abby, Jonah, G Garrett, and Akil. So those are my nine varsity teammates, and they've just helped me grow as a person as well as seniors from past years, Nikita and Ibrahim, as well as my seniors from my ninth grade year, Trejan, Taryn, and Angela.